and guys, I'm Josh Williams with another Minecraft Pocket Edition tutorial, guys. So we're going to show you how to build this build today. And you do not have to have the vines on it. I just like the vines. I just prefer it a little bit more. But yeah, you don't have to have vines on it. So the dimensions for this house are quite small. It's 7 wide, 14 long, and 11 high. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be doing half the build. Then I will cut it once I'm done with that. And I'll have the whole build, like done or whatever you want to say. You'll see in a few seconds. But yeah, both sides are exactly even unless you put the um, unless you just put the vines wherever which you just do on your own. Anyway, so this gets started. So you're gonna wanna have a block right here. So you're gonna start off with one of these old oak wood. So you wanna go up six. Alright, yeah that's a glitch. Alright, four, five, six. And I've been hating that glitch lately. Because it just messes around with a lot of you on um, your stuff. Five and six, I think. No. Anyway, I don't need to do that side. So then you want to go um, 14 logs. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and for the last one, 14. So there should be a, 12, a total of 12 blocks like that of the birch and you want to do two spaces like this in between each so you have a block like this like you want to make it like this that way you cover this up and you have a window for your first floor guys and so I'm going to bring this up right here maybe I won't cut all of this video because it will be pretty easy to do this and then <clears throat> I'll do this front part because I'm going to need it and I think I will never mind I'm just stupid, whatever. So you want to do another layer like this, full on blocks here. This is your fourth block height. And now you want to do the windows again. And for the windows you go like this, doubles. You want to do single, two gaps, two, uh, two gaps, two, and two gaps, and then one block. And, th and then you make a space for your door right there. I'm sorry if this is not that great a video, um, because I am messing up right now probably for tutorial wise I've not done this big of a tutorial before anyway I get that glass out there. and then you just want to put um, glass panes right here as well as you just keep on going forward and so this is basically the main wall I will cut to the back side and then we'll be right back alright guys we're back here and so basically I just finished up that side real quick I didn't put the window panes in I'll do that later I forgot but then, um, once you have the front done, it really doesn't matter right now about putting the glass windows in. I'll do that in a few minutes. But the next step is to go like this, put your oak um, wood off like that so you have like a little crossbar right there. And you want to do it to both sides. I'm going to do the back side right now to show you what the back side is like. So the back side, you're just going to go like this. And you are going to want to do a three long window just because of the fact that it's a little it's off from the front. You could either do two separate windows like that or just a big three long window. But I like the three long window a lot better than the separate windows. And then just do that again to the back. Now at this point you can put the windows wherever you want. I put them a little bit too low, so I'm gonna do it differently this time. I'm gonna put them right there. Hopefully that's not too low. That's the same height, whatever, it's too low. But, um, yeah, I forgot about that. So, anyway, let's do the inside right now. And so, the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to find the third block and do an upper half slab, so it's like that, of the old oak wood. And it's the darkest wood there is. It really matches really good with the birch wood. Um and stuff like that and we'll have the same color wood for the roof as well but we'll be using stairs and other stuff oh and I forgot about doing this right here so yeah so I'm gonna fill in the windows and I'll be right back guys alright guys so I'm done with that and now all the windows are on the side so we're gonna start with the roof guys so when you do the roof you're gonna want to go down one block so you're roof is just a little bit above the it's just the block above the glass that you're doing and you want to use stairs that are the dark the old oak wood 
and you want to go over the side by one. So you're going to do this two times. So I got to get oh, all messed up right there. Um, you're going to don't you just do another layer like this. So I'm going to go real fast on this. And next layer is where it changes up. So to make it kind of look a little bit different, the roof, like curved style, it makes it a lot better. You're going to want to messed up, whatever. You want to get a um, regular old oak block of wood, um, planks, whatever you want to call it, and you're going to just do that so it goes like that. And then you're going to put some stairs that are old oak as well on top of it to give it more of a kind of like curvished look on for your roof. So if you want to see what I mean by that, you're going to have that kind of curved wood um, right there to make your roof look a lot better and so I'm gonna get this side done on camera as well I guess because you guys might be confused I don't know if you guys are or not um so basically you just do this again and then I'm gonna go right here and build the block right there the single man I'm just worried up on my words right this uh, um this tutorial because I'm not used to this anyway and so we just repeated all the stuff that just happened I just showed you earlier and so at this point you are going to be doing another, using another stair so again I need to place a block right there in order to place that and then I'm going to keep on going all the way down here and then you put your final block right here so it's going to be another plank of old oak and this is just it's not used I'm not used to saying these different types of wood as well so let's just hurry this up I do not want to make this too long for you guys but I am a slow builder I believe not really sure you can tell me in the comments below if I am a slow builder or not guys um, yeah, it's hard doing long tutorials like this because it's just constant talking and stuff. Anyway, all right, I broke that somehow. Anyway, now you want to fill in this part. You're gonna to want to go like this, like that. And you want to leave one block in to put the window. In. So I'm gonna do that on the back side, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. So anyway, I'm gonna fill in this floor right now after this video, but after like I do the top roof. But I'll do the decorations right now. So first thing first, you're gonna want that, a um, some fences, and you're gonna want some of these. Right, that was the wrong thing. Some of these carpets. And so what you're basically gonna do is put two fences right here on both sides, and this is gonna make tables on both sides for a nice little decoration. And it makes the house look a little bit more open. You know what, guys? I'm gonna fill in this. Um, floor and I'll be right back all right guys so we're back so um, next step is you want to put some ladders in the back to get to your second floor there's not enough room in this build to actually um, make stairways up um, I need one more block yeah there we go anyway so right now what we're gonna do is we are gonna be making the balcony so you're gonna want to start in the back half of the house and you're gonna want to go out I think four blocks. I can't remember. Yeah, it's four blocks. And then you are going to want to put a stone brick right there and right there. And in order to make this look better, you want to put that right there. So then you're going to put some fences. Not fences. Sorry about that. Um, some ladders going up. And then you're going to want to grab your stone walls and put them right there. Next up is you're going to be grabbing a bed. And a few, what do you call them, uh, bookshelves. And you're going to put the bookshelves right here. It's going to be kind of like a little reading area, I believe. Um, yeah, I put them right here as so. well. And then you're going to kind of make these just, all right, that was kind of weird, but yeah. All right. Um, then you're just going to make your bookshelves like that. And then you kind of have like a nice little area to look out the window and stuff like that. And this apparently did not want to stay there. And then you're going to put your beds right here. And then, yeah, I forgot. 
you kind of have to break these slabs, put that down, and then break the slabs, break the stone, and then put the slabs back, which is very unfortunate. All right, that's. You know what? I'm just gonna do that off camera. Anyway, let's do the last thing on the agenda to finish up this house, and it's on the outside. I'll be out there right in a few seconds. So the last thing to finish up your house is you're gonna want to put a upside down um, st stair of old old oak guys sorry about that and put another one right there try to get it a nice little um just point out and that finishes your build guys and that's it for this episode subscribe like and comment for more tutorials and i promise to get better guys just hope you have a great day bye oh wait never mind i forgot something you have to put your um upside down stairs here as well guys sorry about that just to make it look a lot better and that's all you actually have to do and you have your build finished I would just noticed that when I was working on the last build anyway that's it have a great day and bye